guys and welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Taylor thank you so much for joining us today we are going to get into the Morphe and Jeffree Star new eyeshadow palette I created this look if you want to see how just keep watching he looks bomb AF on the back of this by the way like hello goddess um kind of want to create that look it's super cute all right so i'm going to show you guys what it looks like i did already swatch some of this in store so just let you know um this is what the front looks like it does come with a huge mirror um in it already and then it has some beautiful colors some of these colors actually remind me of his own palettes like some of the greens in here remind me of like the alien palette and stuff they're super duper pretty it even has like this glitter right here that is super sticky which is amazing because then you don't even have to use glitter glue the names on these are super cute and i'm glad he put them on the actual palette um but the top row says welcome back to my channel wand noise super cute very creative um there's some really cute ones in here like glam rapids is named after grand rapids and i guess like this bottom row here was like nate's row which is pretty cool um, but yeah, I'm really excited to use this palette. Um, I literally have so much makeup you guys right now, so I'm hoping to do a bunch of reviews and tutorials with all this new makeup that I have received. Alright, I think I'm going to start off with the color Mr. Diva, which is this one right here. It is just a really good transition shade. Um, I'm going to go in with the M433. This is just going to be my transition shade. Let's get to it. So I've been cream contouring a lot lately and I kind of like it. Um, I got really inspired by Melly Sanchez, um, which is Fashion Freak on Instagram. And, um, yeah, I don't know. I just really like the look of cream contour. It's definitely different than what I'm used to doing. Um, it's definitely more of a snatched look, but I kind of like it. I'm going to take the 506 or the JH40, and I'm going to take that same color underneath as well and kind of connect it together on the outside. So I've also been taking my, my um, makeup pictures outside. But it is really difficult. Like, if you take your pictures outside, you know, like, you have to get there at golden hour. And that only lasts for a little bit. So you only have a small window of time to take pictures. Which I'm not sure how I feel about yet. Like, I just feel like it's a lot. And I don't know if I can continue to do it just because it's so hard. And I don't work from home. I mean, maybe if I ever did work from home, it'd be easier, but it is really hard to take golden hour pictures. I'm going to use the color Self Made, which is this bright pink color right here. Oh my god, that's pink. So just zoomed you guys in just a little bit so you can see a little bit better, but I had a feeling this was going to turn kind of like sunsetty look all right i'm just going to spray my brush with setting spray just so that the color sticks and adheres and becomes the best it can be <laughs> lives its best life The next color I'm going to take is, I think you could say it mogul, I'm pretty sure is how you say it. It's this kind of like magenta color, it's like a darker magenta. And this one I'm just going to deepen the crease with. I've been doing a lot of cool tone looks, um, but I really like the warmth of this look, it's just very pretty.
Alright, I'm going to take the 432 brush, which is the flat top, and I'm going to go in with the color Mogul, and I'm going to use that on my lower lash line. And kind of connect it to the outer part. On the E36, I'm going to take the color Designer Label, which is this light champagne color, I would call it. I'm just going to use this as an inner corner highlight. Alright guys, I'm going to add liner and lashes, and I will be right back to finish up. Alright guys, so this is the finished look. I really love how it turned out. I hope you guys did too. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And yeah, stay tuned for more because I have so much stuff to go through, review, do tutorials, um, do tips and tricks on travel, stuff like that. So if you want to see that, just stay tuned. Keep watching um, my channel and hit that notification bell so you can get notifications for all the new videos. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are having an amazing day and we'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!